1952, the late Reverend Canon John Maynard Waibale, the first African Archdeacon of Busoga region, traveled to the United Kingdom to further his studies. Reverend Canon Dr. Joy Mokisa Isabire, the subdean of Christ's Cathedral, Bugembe, in Jinja City, says in 1952, Busoga region was under Namirembe Diocese of the Church of Uganda. So this young reverend went to the UK for studies, but already he heard that there was an idea of introducing a diocese in Ibusoga. So when he was there, he was fascinated by the various architectural designs in England. And he started dreaming about having one of them in Uganda. The architectural design that fascinated Reverend Canon Waibale the most was the Stave Church, a medieval style of building churches that was once common in northwestern Europe. So in 1953 when he came back, came back from the UK with this design of a cathedral. Actually it's unique. In the whole of Uganda it is the only cathedral which looks like this. Even you can see the sitting, we all face the altar. Yet most of the cathedrals or churches, all people face one side. In 1972, when Busoga became a diocese, already there was an architectural design for the diocese. So, but construction had started in 1969. The former Chabazinga of Busoga, Henry Wakomoloki, donated the land for the building of the cathedral. At the time, the Chabazinga's official residence was a few meters away from where the cathedral sits today, in what is now the Busoga Diocesan Office. So they said at first they had three alternative places to build the cathedral. They were thinking of Masese, they were thinking of Iganga, because in Busoga, Iganga was the first place where the missionaries first established themselves at CMS. But then they saw that it would be best if the cathedral was near the Chabazinga. The first bishop was the Reverend, Right Reverend Spriya Nivamose, 1972 to 1999. Then after him, there was the Right Reverend Dr. Mike Sosa and Chomia, 2000 to 2015. Now the current bishop, the Right Reverend Dr. Paul Samson Naimane, became a bishop in 2016. Christ Cathedral Bugembe, which is the seat of Busoga Diocese, sits on 50 acres of land and seats 1,000 people. The royal wedding slated to take place at the cathedral on 18th November is Busoga's second royal wedding. It will also be the first time royals are joined in holy matrimony at the cathedral. That his Isevan to his royal highness has got a wife. Yeah, Bible says in Genesis 2.18 that God said it's not good for man should be alone and he looked for a suitable helpmate. And then secondly to choose this cathedral, Christ Cathedral of Gembe, are honored because there is another big church in Kamuli where his, which was built by his father. So he could have decided to wait from here. The wedding, however, will not take place within the walls of the cathedral. The Archbishop of Uganda, the Most Reverend Stephen Kazimba, will wed the couple about 100 meters away on the cathedral grounds. Because the President of Uganda, His Excellency, will be attending, and because of recent, he does not uh, come into closed places. You see, whenever he goes, he's an, in an open tent. So photogenics came and did the survey, and they are going to work on that open place. So that's where the wedding will take place, but at Christ Cathedral of Gembe still. Yeah, because that space is for the church. And we hope to have a mass choir with the choir members from all over Busoga, so that the whole of Busoga is represented because the Chavazinga is for the whole of Busoga. St. James Parish Church, where the former Chavazinga, Henry Wakomuloki, wedded in Ebantu, Alice Chintu, on January 21st, 1956, is located on Nile Avenue in Jinja City. Sekabaka Sir Edward Mutesa, Uganda's first president, was his best man. Julian Nantume, NTV Tonight.